All right, so I made a uh, desktop speaker system for my good friend Jason, who has no idea. But uh, what I did was I started off with uh, a box just like this. I got it from Hobby Lobby for about uh, $7. And uh, inside of it, I mounted uh, this a board just like this one right here, which is a TDA P792P or whatever. I'll, I'll put a link in the, I'll put the information in the description uh, inside of there. And I used a couple of uh, three inch uh, speakers I found off uh, Parse Express. They're high, high vi B3Ns. And uh, Here's how it uh, set up. Uh, what I've got in here is two pieces of uh, half inch MDF as the top and the bottom mount with about a three quarter inch gap to allow some space and for everything to set inside of there. Uh, over here I've got a couple of just some faux leather that I kind of uh, mocked up and stuck inside of there to kind of give it a little softer touch. Uh, got this little chain from Hobby Lobby, it's like a necklace or something. For the buttons, I'm using, uh, these are just little wooden dowels that I got off of, I got a Hobby Lobby. And you can see here are just, and I screwed on the bottom there and I lined this up perfectly so it lines up with the, with the, um, with the, uh, the uh, circuit board. Uh, and on the caps there, these are little jean studs that are used to, uh, Put on a jean jacket but they happen to fit perfectly on those wooden dowels so it kind of adds that antique looking effect um and all this is uh, uh glued and set inside here so it's it's an airtight uh enclosure with the exception of these buttons these kind of slide in and out uh, i didn't worry too much about that uh and then the back there i just kind of mounted a uh, 2.1 barrel connection there um, currently I'm rocking running off a 12 volt battery, but, um, I'm going to give him a, a wall. Angle. This isn't really something you would use to like take out into the yard or anything. It's kind of something to sit in your desk, but anyway, I'm kind of proud of this thing. And, uh, it's got these, uh, two by 50 watt, um, amps. So it'll handle a ton of, uh, you can't really get the full effect here and, I can't jack it up anymore on my phone, but anyway, it's it's so loud. You you it'll get so loud you can't even stand it. Uh, uh. So anyway, there you go, man. There's a little uh, speaker I built. Um, total investment here. Let's see, twelve dollars for the module, seven dollars for here, twenty dollars there. Uh, these things I think were like two dollars. Uh, this dude right here, and another two dollars for the chain that I chopped up. This leather I found like clearance for like three dollars for the yard. Uh, the speakers were ten dollars each, so I mean it's like a fifty-dollar steel. You know, I, I sanded and stained it. Um, my neighbor, uh, who is a wood woodworker by nature and uh, uh, and by a hobby, he, he helped me with all that part. So was, that was donated, but really it wouldn't cost that much. I mean, maybe you buy five dollars and and a, and a stain on there, and you would be uh, all set with this thing. It took longer than I anticipated, just because of getting all those measurements just right. Um, but you can see my my desk is covered with just tons of different parts and pieces that I was trying to make work so but anyway uh, hope you enjoy Jason uh, and this is a small tribute uh, to thank thanking you for being such a good friend of me over the last uh, you know what is it 25 26 years maybe longer this is we're eight years old 40 yeah so 30 32 years wow man all right man thanks bud